Welcome back Ark players to a brand new video. Now today we have something very big to talk about today regarding the game and a uh, lot is happening uh, ever since the center did launch. Now let me know how you guys are finding the center. Um, obviously I am away still but I am back very very soon so anyone that is wondering on the mic not having like a filter and stuff don't worry it, i'll be back home soon so it should sound better um but um i'm just going to be covering all of the news we've got a major engine upgrade coming for arc this summer so that could literally be within the next month or so um so let's cover all the news if you guys do enjoy it make sure to smash that like button subscribe if you're new around here and if you do want to get yourself the set a center server um to play on if you haven't got one already the link will be in the description down below Anyway guys, let's hop in with the news and we're going to kick straight off with the tweet from Jeremy. So Jeremy, who's the co-founder at Studio Worldcard, said, FYI, we are working on upgrading Ark Survival Ascended to Unreal Engine 5.4. This will result in major improvements to performance, memory and graphics features, among other things. For all the game's platforms, the ETA for the release is this summer. And someone replied saying, can we promise this time that it will be, uh, this upgrade will be free? And Jeremy said, yeah, <laughs> which, um, you know, is one of those things is obviously it's a bit of a jokey comment because, um, well, you know, the whole Ark Survival Ascended like upgrade from Survival Evolve was meant to be free in the first place. It was actually meant to be a game update until they decided they needed to make big profits and actually turn it into an actual game, um, which um, people didn't realize that was actually the plan at the beginning was um if you didn't know the arc survival ascended wasn't actually meant to be um a thing it was meant to just be a upgraded version of survival evolved um and obviously from money side of things they probably did well when with the launch of survival ascended because they made a lot of uh, buy like lots of people were buying it but then at the same time i think it's actually damaged the the sort of community more than anything because um, there's such a divide between who plays Survival Evolved and who plays Survival Ascended at the moment that it's a bit annoying and I mean Survival Evolved is still going strong with 30k players per day which is crazy to think and Survival Ascended is really struggling on the PC when a nude map comes out it does jump up but to be honest still some people just can't run the game some people just can't um, like don't just don't even like it some people don't like the missing content and that's just really why there's more people playing evolved like the you more people can just run evolved and some people just can't run ascended so that's pretty much what's going on there the next up we did get a new community crunch that i haven't covered yet it was a mighty arrival um which is them talking about the new power rangers kind of dlc type premium mod we don't know what it's going to be whether it's going to be a dlc or premium mod it does seem very 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 like sort of hyped up if it was just going to be a premium mod um i'm not sure what i think of it so far um but um it's going to be launching on or being revealed or launched I, I reckon it'll be a reveal on the 17th of june so there's only eight days to go now so just over a week um until this gets revealed and they say this week we released the center map and our first of our arc fantastic tames the pyromane we're thrilled to see players enjoying the remastered map and they're taming their f uh, fiery kitties uh, thank you for your feedback we have a slew of fixes on the way in the meantime we have so much more in store for you coming really soon and as you can see it says mark your calendars for june 17th as a mighty arrival makes its way to arc survival ascended and and, I mean, we kind of know that it's Power Rangers, right? Unless Jeremy was just trolling us. Um, but, I mean, it definitely looked like it was. And it's going to be weird. Like, I hope it's not a premium mod. Like, I feel like I don't think it will be. Because when they do premium mods, they just tend to do, like, reveals of them and stuff. And they don't do these massive types of things. So, I do think it'll be a DLC Power Rangers type thing. Um, I did. I've told you guys before that um, just about a year ago or maybe just a little bit less than that, maybe 10 or 11 months ago, I said to you guys they're going to be looking to work with larger IPs in the future. Um, and Power Rangers looks 
seems to be the first one they're doing it with. I thought Jurassic World would have been the most perfect thing for them to do. Like, you know, I still don't understand. I mean, I know it comes down to money and stuff, but like an Ark Jurassic World DLC would sell a lot. Um, but I don't know how easy that would be to lock down. Um, so they've decided they've gone with a Power Rangers one. Um, and then they've done Happy. Uh, they've done a post for Happy Pride Month, and it says we're excited to um, unleash a spectrum of vibrant colours for the rest of June. Enjoy times free uh, rates um, every week weekend through June, including breeding and. Um, so you can give your breed lines a dazzling rainbow glow up so you've got dark violet orange red light yellow mint glacial light pink deep pink medium lavender um and um yeah so that's a new event i don't know how long how oh they said it's every it's, it's through throughout the whole of june um and then the center ascended and arc fantastic tames and pyromane alive like we've talked about um so you can grab one um i still haven't obviously played because i'm on holiday um and but i i have i've i've, I've been said I, I think there was a new ras clark video that came out i haven't watched it yet and uh, I think it was talking about it was the video was titled "We Need to Talk About This," and I did talk about it in another video. And I was saying that I wasn't too happy with the the pyromane being like a paid creature. And lots of people said to me, "Dom, come on, it's five dollars. Like, stop moaning." But then. I think what I saw Nooblet say, um, which is another YouTuber, which I thought was very, very, very true, is it all starts as this, right? It all starts as, um, oh, this is a $5 creature, and then it ends up becoming like World of Warcraft or something, and then you've literally got a $50 flaming huge dragon to buy, you know? And I'm not saying that's the way that Ark will go down, but you never know. If they if they saw that they're making good money off the Pyro main, then they're going to try and make something bigger and better, and then they might end up making like... Um, sorry about that and um, they might end up making like a, a limited edition version of the you know the the fantastic tames where this one is now $25 and you know it can it can fall down and into a terrible spiral of things where they're just lifting the prices up for bigger and more badder creatures you know and then it ends up we're paying crazy amount of money because they realize that they can make it and all i'm saying is we've got to watch out we don't want it to turn into a slippery slope we don't want it to turn into a mobile game um because i'm not going to lie to you guys if it does turn into a game where you have to purchase all different types of creatures i just won't buy them anymore um just because uh, i want to support the game um and i don't mind paying for creatures that are five dollars i will do it when i get back but if it does go down this line of um you know we're paying forty dollars for a, for a bunch of creatures you know because back in the day we used to pay um we used to pay for a season pass which was 25 30 dollars whatever it was um and that was it um and now we're starting to pay we could end up paying for a creature pack throughout the years that so you you know instead of going from spending um $25 the entire time you're going to end up spending $500 to a thousand they're going to turn into EA right but anyway I'm not saying it's going to get that bad but I just thought it was a really good post from Nooblets and um, I just think we need to be careful but anyway that's enough um, on that um, and then they just said that there was a live ups update they said they're just going to um, uh, it's like a major update for the center which includes numerous fixes i think that went live the other day uh conquest servers are coming on june 13th um for from arc survival ascended um and then there was another mod spotlight so so i think that's pretty much everything to cover in today's video um there's a how to tame the pyromane here from cheese the dj or cj the cheese dj um i do like watching his videos a lot um but yeah I think that's pretty much everything ARC related to talk about today, guys. Um, obviously, yes, I know many of you have said, Dom, you're loving Helldivers more and you're just covering ARC less. Why don't you just completely give up with ARC instead of complaining about it all the time? And I know that's what I have been doing um, since January. If you don't, if you haven't noticed on my channel, I've, I've been playing a lot of Power World and then I stopped when that kind of died down and I'd done everything that I could do. Um, and then I started playing Helldivers and been really enjoying that but that doesn't mean guys that 
I'm going to ever go away from ARK. Um, I think if you are a true ARK player, you will know you have a love and hate relationship with the game for m as many as nine years. Um, and it's not something that you can just be like, right, I'm done with. Um, and I've been covering content for so for so long. And if there is ever a day where I completely get sick of it, I would let you guys know that and I would properly do a proper goodbye video but that's not where my head is at the moment at all i really love this game i've been in the community as i said for nine years and uh, you know just because i may be getting decent views on another game that doesn't mean arc will be going away um you know when gta 6 comes out i'm going to be covering gta 6 content and that you know that could be massive you never know but arc has been there arc built this channel and um you know i just can't ever imagine my channel with it not being arc because i just love being a part of the community and yeah so that's everything guys thank you very much for watching and i will catch you guys and another thing actually just to add on to that who doesn't love the big as much as we all have that hate love and hate relationship with arc who doesn't love that big announcement days and stuff like the things coming up on june 17th it's one of the most hyped things when the community are all together getting excited for it so catch you guys in my next video leave a like subscribe and thank you for watching